Enter for a chance to win an awesome prize. All you gotta do is be subscribed and like my videos. For more information, check the description box below. This video is sponsored by Fanatic.dk. What is going on guys? Dr. Joe here with another Pokemon video. Today we're searching for Hyper Rare Tap You Lele in Guardians Rising. And hopefully we can pull it. Uh, I would also like to see a double colorless energy in Secret Rare, that would be pretty sweet. And before I start the video, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Pokemon product openings. Alright you guys, so let's pop this one open. Again, I'm not good at this. Probably never will be good at it, but... Uh, that's just how it goes. There we go. So the wrapping's off. Let's pull this straight up here. Ah, looking very good. The right way or the right lane, because I'm a right lane kind of guy. There we go. All right, you guys. Let's see if we can pull this one. Just have to. There we go. So, um, the codes are like this, so not much of a surprise today, you guys. Should we do the card trick? Yeah, we can do the card trick. I'm just gonna go past them real fast because there's not gonna be much of a, you know, incentive of me to tell you what the cards are. But Aether Paradise Conversion Area and a Garbodor. Okay, so nothing too interesting for the first pack, but we knew that before we started this one. Let me just make room for the bulk. There we go. Do, 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 do. Green coat once again. Okay. Let's not do the card trick uh, if it is a green coat, because that's not going to be too interesting, because we already know we're not going to get anything particularly good. That's actually pretty funny, you know, that we actually got Trevenant and Thantump. So, okay, <laughs> it's so fun when this happens. Uh, never actually paid attention uh, to it, but then Darium over at Darium's Pokemon said, make sure you check this out. Okay, very good. So we have a white coat for this pack. Let's see what we can get here, you guys. Fairy Energy, Multi-Switch, Sligu, Aether Paradise Conversion Area, Carvana, Barboach, uh, Phantom, Match up, fledgling, and for our reverse, we have a pet rat, and it's a full art dram part GX. Yes, very awesome. That card is actually being played a little bit, I believe. Shown to be pretty good. Let's just see here. So, for one colorless energy or any energy, uh, you can discard a special energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Uh, Berserk for three is if your bench Pokemon have any damage counters on them, this attack does 70 more, so that's 150. Seems pretty good. Uh, it's not even a GX attack, so that that is actually pretty all right. Uh, it's also basic Pokemon, so you can just play it straight away. Big Wheel for one, it's the GX ability. Shuffle your hand into your deck, then draw 10 cards. Wow, okay, so. Now I pretty much understand why that card is played, and now we also know why the full art version is gonna be, you know, worth more to some people since they wanna play with the full arts. So I don't think there's gonna be anything too interesting in this pack, so we can just skip. Okay, Politoed Reverse, rare, that's actually pretty good. Uh, Salasal Non-Hollow is however not that good. Yeah, nothing too interesting in these. Oh. There we go. My OCD is gonna flip if, okay, there we go. So, are we actually gonna get another GX right here? Grass Energy, Marini, Fletchinder, Sableye, Machop, Trubbish, Delibert, Yang, Jangmo, Taylo, Glalie, uh Reverse, pretty cool. And a Chandelure Hollow. Okay, actually not that bad. Pretty good uh, pack, considering no GX pull. Oh well, that's just how it goes. Another white coat already? Kidding me? 
Okay, so you guys, we have water energy. We have wish, uh, <laughs> whimsicott. Sorry about that. Aether paradise conversion area. Oh, <laughs> this is not my day, as you can see. Alone and Graveler. Patillet. Trebish. Machop. It's actually different Machops in this one. Never noticed. Alone and Judo. Mudbray. Vanillite as our reverse and a Tapu Coco GX. Okay. Yeah, it's actually uh, a pretty good card. Should we uh, should we check out the abilities that we did before? Uh, let me know in the comments if you would actually like me to continue doing this. Uh, I actually think it's pretty cool, so I might. Uh, but let me know what you think. So Tapu Coco has the ability Arrow Trail. Uh, when you play this Pokemon from your hand onto your bench during your turn, you may move any number of uh, lightning energy from uh, your other Pokemon to this Pokemon. Uh, if you do, switch this Pokemon with your active Pokemon. Okay, that's actually pretty good. Uh, Sky High Claws, that's 130 damage for 3 energy. And then the GX ability is Tap You Thunder. This attack does 50 times, uh, I mean 50 damage times the amount of energy attached to all of your opponent's Pokemon. Mm, yeah, okay. Uh, don't know about that last one, because that really depends on the matchup. You know? But most likely your opponent is going to have, well, at least some energy attached to the Pokemon. So that's going to be, yeah, I, I suspect it'd be all right. Pangoro, non-hollow, and our reverse, Oricorio. Yeah. Seems all right. It's nothing too crazy, but it does seem all right. Yes, another green, Litwick, Gathita, Panchamp, Alolan, Vulpix, Chansey, Whalmer, Reverse, and Oricorio once again. But this time, not a reverse. We're not getting any Aqua Patches or Choice Bands. I want to see more of those. Another green, Selendite, Stuffle, Slowpoke, Wishiwashi, Nosepass, Reverse, Sableye, and Honchkrow, non hollow. Oh yeah, there we go. Aqua Patch. Get down there, buddy. Oh, what is it? Oh, that was the, okay. <laughs> I am not paying attention today, sorry guys. Usually my, uh, my card management on this beautiful Super Mario playmat has always been pretty good, but today, yeah, I'm all over the place. Another green, really? Been a while since we've seen something. Karana, Fletchling, Gudra, Reverse. That's actually pretty good. And a uh, Gothletti. Yeah, okay. It's actually a pretty all right pack, considering it being a white coat, I mean, uh, a green coat, so. Oh. Ah. So. <laughs> I don't know what happened right there, but we have a, a white coat, so water energy, rescue stretcher, soda widow, metang, cleverry, litwick, gligar, vanillite, mutbray, oricorio in reverse, and a wishy-washy GX. Yeah, okay, maybe not the pull that I was hoping for with the GX, but wow, already three GXs and we're still only a little bit over half through this part of the box. So three GXs, yeah, I'll take that. Let's see how many packs we have left here, seven. So yeah, a little bit more than over, but that's how it is. So you guys, green code once again, so nothing too interesting in this pack either. Altar of Mune, and Lunala, that's actually, okay. That's pretty cool. Solgaleo would have come up there and be like, trolling you bro, trolling. Don't see me trolling. White coat, so. Is it another GX or is it just a regular hollow? So we have an lightning energy, Machoke, Slowbro, Watchog, Carvana, 
Patarat, Garthita, Cast Form, Tentacle, Wimpod Reverse, and a Victini Hollow. I actually got some pretty good hollows so far. Not gonna complain at all. Yeah, it's very nice. Cause you know, even if you're getting hollows, you should be pretty happy when, when they're good. So yeah, pod, match up, holla, reverse, and sharpedo. Holla reverse is actually all right. Another aqua patch, yeah. Get down there, buddy. So what do we have for this pack? It's another green, you guys. We have a lone and golem reverse, pretty good. A talon flame. Yeah, an all right pack. Max potion, yeah, okay. Haven't seen any choice bands, so. Well, I'm, I wanna get aqua patches, so it doesn't really hurt me. Oh, this is a green coat spree, you guys. We're not getting anything right now. Uh, Vanillish and Oricorio. Oh, I messed that up, there we go. And nothing too interesting in the uncommons either. Two packs left, you guys. Can we pull another GX or maybe a secret rare? Uh, not in this pack. <laughs> That's for certain. Murkrow, Lone and Sand Slash, Machop, Wishiwashi, and Heliolis, not hollow. Well, Wishiwashi reverse. That's actually pretty nice if people are actually playing Wishiwashi GX. So, final pack, you guys. <laughs> I messed that up. Oh, come on, Are you kidding me? I hope there's something good in this one. Okay, it is a white coat, so hopefully we get something awesome. We have Steel or Metal Energy, Machoke, Slowbro, Watchhawk, Catform, Vanillite, Murkrow, Selenite, Nose pass. Salassal reverse. Pretty good. And a Toxapax GX. Okay. Again, not one of the GXs I wanted to see. But I'll take a GX. It's at least better than a non hollow or just a regular hollow. So. Yeah. This one has been. Well, it depends on how many GXs or secret rares we find in the rest of the box, but so far, yeah, pretty average. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Please remember to thumbs up, comment, share, all that good stuff, you know the drill. It helps other people find my channel, and it makes it possible for me to do more videos for you guys. So again, thank you so much for watching this video, and don't forget to subscribe.